good. See hello, it's me, Vokter, again. I've got some uh, designs here from Royal Angel to test out. First one here is Santa Cross. Um, I did change the head because I kind of feel like this maybe got the Santa look more than the hood you gave me. Um, since you were looking for cut something bearded, eh, kind of gets it. White hair, we'll go with it. So, bazooka, shield, missiles, EO core. Not particularly powerful, I don't think. I mean, it's got a lot of AP, though, and it definitely got some hard-hitting weaponry, so... Let's see how I want to play this one. Probably at range. Probably be good. Dash and jumping is always nice, especially if it's going to want to stay away. Let's put out some more defensive tendencies. Just so if it's going to try and play a range game if it's weapon set. It doesn't have the maneuverability for close range. So it's probably, yeah, let's just do no operation chips and see what it does. I think I know what I want to put on it, though. Yeah, just simple test. Test bot to get destroyed. Let's go, Santa. Dodge, though. It's not doing bad though. So I think I'm ready to put this thing up against some more powerful opponents just to see how it does. Uh, it needs to not walk though. Come on, Santa, what are you doing? This AC is not going to sit in your lap. But yeah, let's just see what it does to get something more powerful. Um. I mean, I don't, particularly, I don't think if the weapon setup is going to do particularly well overall. Like, if you were to, I think, if, if you get designed more closer to the meta and all that. Oh, wait, wrong, 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 wrong. Ignore, ignore the white bot for now. Ignore it. Um, yeah, let's do an AC4 design. That's a fun, that's always fun to watch. Yeah, let's, um, I think this will be a good test here. Just to see if it, because Orlin's less AP and all that. And it'll be a good test of, can it keep it range? This isn't something that's designed to get close and use its blade. Come on. I mean, it's that shield. Come on, use your shield. What are you not using your shield for? There you go. It's running that thing out of its EO, though. That's good. I'd say definitely, yeah, I guess as far as not the most powerful, I guess it's one of those. It's got powerful hard-hitting weapons. It's really going to be a question of is it going to get outmaneuvered or out dps so. Well then, that's Orleans right there. Prometheus would probably be a good one, though. That one, I mean, did really well in a video I did, I think, very recently. Might have been the latest video I did. Wrong one again. There's that. Oh no. Looks like Prometheus might have this one. Yeah, Prometheus has enough maneuverability, I think, to counter most of what. Ooh, ECM, ouch. Yeah, 
Yeah, it's just like its weaponry doesn't have like enough steady firepower, I'd say. As in like, well, Prometheus' advantage is being able to stay at range, dodge some shots, and just pelt, and just constantly pelt. So, at the same time, the AP, like, it can't be like, AP, that AP does go down. Ooh, the bazooka's gone. Yeah, that's another weakness of this thing, is that, uh, low ammo on the bazooka. Probably be much better with the AP. But... And if it uses TOs more. I mean, that was all of a sudden went from like 2,700 to uh, under 2,000, so that's pretty good. You definitely hit hard, it's just like ammo is going to be an issue with it. <laughs> I don't know, I don't think maneuverability, I don't, I don't think the operation chips are really going to help in this case. So, I think overall, I'm going to leave it as is and go work on the other bot, then, then I'll pull him back in. So, let's get Ruger here. He didn't give me a paint job, so I just still stuck with the basic um, one I used for the test ACs. What do I want? What do I want? Uh, let's see. So we got missiles, side shields, and then rifles. So this one will probably... I'll set it up similar to uh, prop, something like set up Prometheus. So I guess some more longer range ones here. This one I think is definitely going to have more potential here. I'll, I'll put Ruger against Santa Cross and see... No, I don't want to run up. Holy jeez. <sighs> Honestly, I think an enemy might be wasted, or I can get away if less. But heat and energy, I just I always make sure those are up. Probably doesn't need any, honestly. Other than the extend range one. This one's probably going to play very similarly to Prometheus. And, mmm, that versus Prometheus would be a good fight, though. That would be a very good fight. What does he have on the insides? I forget. I think it's... Decoys. I might want to, I think, I want to test something here, where I don't want it running like it is. So maybe if I um, put it more on stable, it might be good. It doesn't even touch the ZO. Of course this one's annoying. But I mean, it's already still got really good weapon setup for like... Got the linear rifle to help stun enemies rather than just like a rifle sniper rifle. The rifle sniper rifle for Prometheus is still pretty good. Let's just see what happens. Which, if this works out, I'll probably do the same on Santa Cross. Just the same as well. Because, I mean, overall, these two seem to like they play in similar ways. But yeah, this Ruger AC, it's like an all crest exclusive, except for like code on optional part on there. And maybe another one, so it's like, is it really, really crest exclusive? I don't know. Well, it's stable, it seems like it's going to boost for longer periods of time. Still, still walking more than I wanted to, though. And... 
Yeah, I think it was better varied. It's not really a Justin that's walking, dude, even though that's put on one minute. Ooh. It actually pulled out CF. Damn. Yeah, let's put it back at varied, I guess. And I think I know how I want to set up operation ships. Since I'll probably want to use the same things on um, Santa Cross, I'm only going to use two. One does seem to be doing better though. Why are you getting closer? <laughs> oh my gosh. I know all these weapons can reach out from from touch from further. Yeah, definitely the, the linear rifle is stunned right there. Hmm. How would a tank... Well, then again, I was thinking a tank, like, if the left linear rifle, then the linear gun on the back. But then again, it's like, that linear gun already does so much stun by itself, it'd probably be better off a bazooka or something. That can also hit hard and stun. So, I think I'm overall happy with um, Ruger here. So I haven't really put it. Let me just go with just Santa Cross and I'll get back to. Now let's get Ruger to fight some actual opponents here. Yeah, let's do this one here. This should be interesting. This should be entertaining to watch. Staying, excuse me there, it's not staying at range as much as it should, but then again, it's not particularly fast. So let's change the map up here. There we go. AC4 bots again. Let's get critique in here. Fat and slow and hilarious. Look at that, it's even being fought on the map that, except probably the closest map on the, in this game to what uh, you fight him in AC4. Look at that, good job. Sorry about that, I'm just like about to sneeze earlier and just cling to my nose. Um So overall, okay, it got down. 
Yeah, I'd say overall, looking at Ruger here, it's decent. got decent weapon setup. I think it's just not mobile enough to take advantage of it. That's what I'm seeing here. I think I'm happy. Let's, um... Old research team here. I still have that saved here. Let's watch it get something. Like, Sprinkles, I mean, isn't nearly... Like, it's weapon setup. I mean, isn't nearly... Is, yeah, isn't nearly as, um... I would say as potent in a way, but has the mobility to make up for it. So it should be an interesting fight. Yeah, if it gets stuck on a wall, then its mobility isn't going to matter. Oh, this, this thing's charging. Look at that. It has stealth missiles, yet it's still having missiles get caught in vehicle. But again, I think it has extension missiles, too. Like, we see the difference here with, like, the weapon set. Yeah, I'd say, that overall, this AC does not have the mobility to make the, make the best use of its weapons. What from Ruger? I mean, not from Ruger. Let's see what did the most damage here. So the Sylph actually did a lot of damage. So did the linear rifle. I like how uh, none of the stealth missiles hit. That's hilarious. <laughs> So I think overall, I think we'll end this video with uh, with that uh, with meme bot. Let's see. So actually, we'll do. Let me go ahead and save these so that I can put Ruger versus Santa Cross and see how they fight each other. This should be a fun one. Um, yep, I know they see equipment's incomplete. Get Ruger, maybe another legit match here. Actually, I'm thinking. No, not this AC. There we go. Let's see how Santa Cross performs against a nuclear or a nuclear equipped tank. <laughs> I really hope it beats Tank. Like, I hope it does. Oh no, oh no. Oh no, oh. It's got decoys, it's safe from the nukes. Question, oh wait, is it pulled out its, it's Oh, oh no. Oh no. Come on, Santa. Come on, Santa. Ooh, nice dodge, nice dodge, but it's still in the AP to depth. I don't know if this thing come on, you gotta pull out your EO if you're gonna beat this thing. Oh, oh wow. That was that was actually beautiful. And it's still focusing on the missile, it seems like. Make sure it goes away. Okay, there we go. It's beating the tank. Imagine if this is LR with heartbreaking. That was good. Like watching all those missiles explode above it. More meme bots. This is mostly to watch Santa get destroyed. And then, then we'll say Santa will somehow win, I guess. What are we gonna get? Ready. 
So after this, it'll be Santa versus Ruger, and then uh, I think I'll end the video with one of my own designs that apparently uh, Potato BB did a punch as far as making the video. <laughs> Is this thing actually beating Shield Meta? Is that what I'm watching right now? Those dodges, holy sh... Wow, this is impressive. This is actually impressive. Well, once that laser candy gets a fix on it, it's going to just die. So now it's just gonna die. Oh yeah, this thing's getting shredded. Come on, you gotta use your EO. <laughs> Bad. It didn't do bad, but I was surprised that some of those dodges early on. Once it pulled out its pulse can, it was just like you're dead. All right, this should be a fun one to watch. Let's do best of three for this. Santa, probably because it has enough, I think the weapon just hit hard enough to make up for potential places. Yes. And decoys. Oh, is this getting more interesting? Oh, they both have decoys. Oh, yeah, actually, they probably both do. Well, that was the, certainly decisive from Santa Cross there. I think that's what the advantage Santa Cross has is its weaponry. It's bigger frame, but it's got stuff that hits hard. We should cover for some of its faults. Uh, oh, this map. This ought to be entertaining. Oh yeah, this is very decisive. This is very decisive. I think that shield's helping. I don't think it's necessary. Oh no, it's out of its bazooka. Oh no. Oh, and it's charging. That's that's not good. So you see, it has no offense. It's best chance is a TO core, which it's about to get back. It better pop it up. Oh no. Oh no. This is not. Good. Ooh, that was close. Looks like we're going to a third fight. And we're here again. Really, game? Really? I'll let it play out. It was close. Let's watch it from Ruger's perspective here. Getting the early smacks in, but if we look at ammo... If we're looking at ammo here, then... That yeah, bazooka is gonna run out. And it's charging. Oh. That's a 
lot of AP that's going to have to make up. And Bazooka's gone. Oh, Ruger's just still plugging at it. Yeah, I'm, I'm seeing Ruger win this. Because it's too, the Santa doesn't know what EOs are. Santa pulls out EOs, I think he's got it. This is so ridiculously close. Oh what? Well, take that result as you will. Um Yeah, let's uh finish this up with some uh memes. So Alright, give me a sec. There we go. What to make it? Let's have it go through the meat team here. This ought to be entertaining to watch. At the end, I'll do um this thing versus Santa Cross and Ruger after it tries to beat meat team. <laughs> Look at this drift. So good. Oh my god. Is it winning? A lie. Why are you winning? It is also hilarious how it like, gets its own minds. It's pretty hilarious. Oh no. Still winning. Oh no. This might be it. <laughs> this design's hilarious. Before I get copyrighted, though, no. don't monetize this stuff anyway. So, you know, I imagine the song will probably get YouTube before I detect song and then make this advertisement, but not money for me. So, yeah. come on, beat the pigeon. It hits its minds a lot, but at the same time, its minds are usually pretty effective. So... See, look at this thing. It hits its own minds. It's, it's hilarious. Oh, oh, it just got shit on. Oh, no. Oh, no. Don't tell me you're gonna lose to a pigeon. Oh, no. It's got rocket on the back, too. Sure, it won. I don't need to look. Should have beat the pigeon, I'm pretty sure. Oh no, this map. This ought to be interesting. Come on, drift! It's drifting. Oh no. Oh no. Come on, you gotta beat the grill master. Don't let it fry you. Don't let it blow your engine. Shitty references are shitty. Oh no. Oh no. No. What are you doing? No, it's actually doing a whole lot of damage though. It's actually pretty cool. Don't let the grill master destroy you. Oh, is it gonna actually- Oh my god, did it actually ride itself? Oh no. <laughs> this design is more effective than it has any right to be.
Our song almost up. Yeah, our song's almost up, so I gotta be ready to change it. Who's gonna win? Who's gonna win? This thing is ter terrible at dodging missiles. And then it does that. Max to oh jeez! Drift! Drift! Next song. And we're redoing that. Or not. Well you I was gonna lose anyway. It's got so low defenses. Pretty sure four nukes can actually take that thing out. Pretty sure four nukes is like, I'll take that thing out just because of how low its AP and defenses are. Oh wait, is it actually gonna fire its- Oh no! No, what are you doing? Don't- Wait. Wait. Oh jeez. On. You gotta beat the beams. That tank is just bad. She's still bad. Oh man. That's... Still got a couple pigeons. Nuclear Pigeon absolutely destroys this thing, but... Um, Wait, Pigeon needs to fire nukes. That's what it needs to do right now. Look at this thing, it hits its own mines! It's great! It's great! Oh, 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 that damage. No, don't let it fire its nukes! Okay, it's not firing its nukes. And it got destroyed. It doesn't even have to get nuked to get destroyed. It just sucks if it gets missiles. I probably could use decoys instead of mine, but no. That would make too much sense. Back to the desert. That's right, you're just gonna just walk into lasers. Because that's an effective strategy. So at the same time you're starting out dancing things. Oh no. Lasers. Oh no. Oh no. It's it's turned on. It's hurt all the drifts. And it's winning. Oh my god. It beat the laser pitch because it decided to drift. It's great. It's great. Um couple actually and actually I did some fights with it against AC4 bots earlier against um, Orleans and uh, Prometheus. Um, let's just do those two because I want to see if it can repeat because it's managed to beat both of them. It's kind of concerning. It's actually kind of concerning like beat Prometheus with like over a thousand AP left and it was like why? Why? Oh I need a new song here. Oh, oh, oh. Shit. Yes. 
sec. Get some music. Here we go. And it's just getting shot. This fight's closer than it has any right to be. Drifting! <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> oh my god. Oh my god. Oh, this should be a good fight. Plenty of cover. Close range versus long range. Let's go. Oh no, here we go. Maximum drift. I think it's hilarious to watch. I think it's doing better against Prometheus than it has any right to. It just moves so fast. Wait, is it actually? Oh no. It's taking the lead. It's gonna take the lead. It's taking the lead. How will it ever recover? How will Prometheus ever recover? Oh. Close, this is close. Don't leave the area. And the song is building up. Who's gonna get the beat on the other first? Oh! Oh my god! Oh my god! This is too good! <laughs> Alright, as I, as I promised, um, Ruger and uh, Santa Cross will come out. Out since Santa, since Ruger won, Santa Cross will go first. Come on, who's gonna win? I don't know who's gonna win this. I want it. I want. I want the drift. I want the drift to win, just because it's so fast. At the same time, it's <laughs> great. You're not supposed to drift. You need to jump, you're supposed to drift, not jump. You don't need height, you need speed. I don't know what that bazooka halo is at. Oh no, it's not dodging. Oh. Well, drift lost. Come on, Ruger. Song's almost up. And so. Finish this up. Here we go. This ought to be hilarious. Shit. I wasn't paying attention to the fight, but it's close. Oh no. I think it's no right to be doing as well as it is. Oh 
Oh, Ruger's taking the lead back. Oh, oh, geez, that was good. You know what? Let's do the rest of the AC4 team, maybe. Or, actually, no, let's do uh, Drift versus Drift. Oh, on this map, too. Okay. AP, that's great. I want to watch that one again, just on a better map. No, I want the game choose a better map. This would be a good map for drifting. I mean, it's kind of like part of a mountain pass, you could say. That's that mines. All right, let's watch that again. One more, and then I'll call it the video. hear me over the music or not but I kind of don't care the music's more important um that was fun so uh, <laughs> let me know what you think and what you want to see and so uh, see you all later